Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Bobby, and today we're gonna to check out a game called The Hand of Merlin. This game comes out May 11th. I wanna thank the devs and publishers for an early review copy. I'll probably be uploading this on the day of release. So this is a roguelike tactical strategy game, and we're gonna play the game for about half an hour to an hour. And if you guys are interested, make sure to check out for my first impressions review video that I'll be uploading along beside this. So what if? A cataclysmic event that tore open a celestial doorway for aliens, monstrosities to sleep into the Arthurian Bretagne. How would the Knights of the Round react to a cosmic horror from beyond? What if Merlin was a trans-dimensional being trying to save the world? Not one world, but infinite ones. Oh man. Okay, so this game is hard. Uh oh. So we're probably gonna die a lot. Okay. Early access, bugs, etc. Okay, let's go. Uh, I'm excited. Wow, check it out. Wow, I like how- oh, I was about to say like that looks like hard mode just by looking down here. A more lenient rule sets. Heroes start with increased health. Enemies have reduced attributes. Max mana is 7. Why not just do normal? I'm assuming normal is the intended way to play, right? A challenging rule set for the experience and turn-based tactics. Standard health and armor. Standard everything. Yeah, let's go. Why not? Why the heck not? Okay. What's, what are we looking at here? I'll let you know if I'm ever covering anything with the cameras. Uh, Merlin's core. Cores? Oh, I guess this is like you're starting. Like, it's a roguelike, so you're like you're starting loadout or whatever, right? Unlock powerful guardian spells. Essences. Shards of Merlin's power. Unlock spells. Current essence one. Uh, what are these? Uh, spend an essence to unlock. Oh, we're going to unlock one right now. So this is a passive. So the, these are probably permanent upgrades. So every time we like, okay, 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 I got you, I got you. So we get this one. When casting a spell, no attacks can miss for the remainder of the turn. Ooh. Uh, restoration. Restores eight. On use, seven stacks of evading to everyone. Whoa, 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 whoa. And this one is teleport to target position. How about we play pretty basic and get a restoration spell? There goes my essence. It's gone now. Oh. Uh. Okay. So let's not worry about these because we don't have any other essences yet. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Hand of Merlin. Select three heroes for your party. Oh. Oh. These are all ready to unlock. Uh. Defeat a behemoth while in the. Okay. So let's not worry about that. So it looks like we have to only get these three heroes. So we got Brunor. Uh, do I choose three? How do we choose three? Is it already chosen? Alright, so let's see. Let's just look a little bit at the stats here. Health, armor, power, range, speed, and evasion, starting skills. And, uh, yeah, okay. So I'm assuming these are all probably names of people in the... Oh, you drag. Hero party? How do, how do you do that? Drag. Oh, add selected hero. Yes. Start the game. All right. Well, no choices, so we might as well just jump into it. This looks awesome. The quality looks amazing so far. Woo. Okay. Nice. You can see my character's HP and stuff over here. The Holy Grail. For many nights now, the spirit of Merlin has haunted your dreams. It speaks to you a darkness from beyond this world. A darkness that will tear apart everything you know and love. That is why Merlin has reached out his hand and gathered those who already stand against the cataclysm. Hear the voice of Merlin. This is your task, Merlin voice whispers. You must seek Camelot, where the Grail awaits. Take it, and make your way across Albion to Corvenic. Brave the dangers of the Marca Hispanica. Journey through the all on all uh, Andalus and cross the wide sea until you reach Jerusalem. There your world will be saved or ended. After many days of travel, you have arrived at Camelot. For you lies the heart of Albion, King Arthur's dream made manifest. Here you will find the Grail and begin your quest. So we get money. What the hell's that? Supplies and one mana and a uh, renown. Cool. Okay. So that's our starting gear. Camelot is almost as beautiful as it was in Arthur's day. King Gawain has done all he can to preserve it. But the passage of time and the weakness of the realm is visible in small matters. The armor of the knights does not shine as it once did. And the round table is full of scratches. There is a sense of fraying of decay held at bay. Request an audience with the Kang. Uh, you can read this if you want. 
Ah, damn it. You know, okay. Because this is a roguelike, you know, like the Binding of Isaac, uh, Slay the Spire, lore is kind of secondhand. It's up to you whether or not you want to really deep dive into lore. It's mostly about the strategy and the different choices and stats, you know? So here, we can always choose one of two. Gain Honor or Gain Fortitude. So this is a relic. I wonder if these are equipable or these are whatever. Um, one stack of Bear of Honor. Bear of Honor. When missing an attack, get one action point does not decay. Uh, bear is granted one stack of Bear of Fortitude. When assailed by a negative status effect, negative two from attacks. Oh. I like this one. If you miss, you get to go or you get one action. I like that. Oh, look at that. This guy got it. I wonder if I can move it around. All right. You guys can read that if you want. Take the medicine or take the Ortonox bone. What is this? A relic? It's a zero cooldown, one use. Clear R status effects. Oh. Except for aura. It says all, so it doesn't like it could mean ally and you know enemy buffs. Or the medicine. I'll take the medicine. And we get to get one of these concoctions. What the hell's happening? Uh let's see. Brune, Marer. Oh, oh, oh. Uh four health restored after taking damage to health on turn start. Expires. Losing all stacks after applying this effect. Alright, we'll give it to you. Begin your journey. Alright. I'm gonna sneeze. Hold on. Ha, ha, ha. Okay, let's go. These hits will help you understand the game system. Click on the question mark if you want to know. Okay. Uh. Hello, get. Alright, so you can keep track here if you want. And also relics. Wow, there's a lot of different relics. Okay. So let's see. Uh, your location is represented by the hand symbol. You can move the camera with the wasp. The I was gonna actually, I moved my hand over here to do the arrows, but I should have tried wasp first. <laughs> if there are no active encounters, then click on a node and go again. Your objective is to reach Corbenic. That's your first step upon reaching Jerusalem. So pretty much this will act sort of kind of like a lot of uh, roguelikes where you do one area, you beat it, go through another area, you beat it, go through another area, and you get to the end. It's not a bad, um, you know, template or anything. It's really up to you. This looks cool. So, okay, so this is the end. So we have to choose where to go. So it seems like you can go anywhere, but you might have to worry about supplies. Um, show all no labels. Oh, yeah, I like that one. Options, Codex, Guardian Core. So as soon as we get a new, um, I guess we'll find out. So there's regular no types. Which means what? What are regular ones mean? Cities, arcane, heroic, corruption indicators, danger, and reward types. Okay, so we started here. Do we have to start here? I guess we move. So we have to do nothing but the regular node. So these are random events. I'm going to guess battles and choices, right? So look at the sky. Watch out for the rain and move on. I get 31 bucks. Okay, so I don't know. What's this castle of maidens? I kind of want to go that way. It seems dangerous. You can see the uh, the extreme danger. Ooh, extreme danger sounds pretty bad. How about we go down this way? There's a lot of regular nodes. And we head to the city of Orzish. It's kind of a boring all way, low, huh? We, we kind of want to see Arcade Node. Um, Let's go to the right. All right, visit the market or seek the wisdom. I have money. Let's see how much things cost. Purchase supplies or sell supplies. Well, we need supplies. We don't have much. Ask why the king is not sent help. Defeat the bandits. Oh, crap. All right, here we go. Let's go. Let's begin. I'm excited. All right, let's see how the battle is. Welcome to your first skirmish. Wasty or whatever. Uh, press the character or tab. You got it. Tab. Okay, so we got three characters. Can I move the camera? I think it's stuck to... It's stuck to, to this format here. Okay, so we got, uh, oh, four enemies, huh? So, how does this go? Okay, so it looks like we got action points, movements, and uh, these are powers in his mana. Okay, so I just, we, we choose and we go. This is preview, hold control. Toggle to ability preview. Switch between unit outline modes. I like that one better. Always. Switch between units, fill, uh, extended tooltips. Huh? 
All right, let's begin. So I'm gonna use Bruner. Uh, wait, what kind of moves everyone has? Okay, so he has um, move. So two movements up to two, up to five, up to five. Oh, okay, see, so it's like XCOM. So up to five uses one AP. You wanna go further, you sprint using two. I got you. And then this one uses one AP, one turn, so you can use it every single turn. Range is 1.5 tiles. I wonder what a 1.5 means. Like if I stand here, that's two. How do you do half a hit? Maybe when they're behind a thing. And then this is a bash. This is a cooldown for two turns. Deal four damage. If it's not a large target, you knock them back and you disrupt their actions. Hmm. Four damage. All right, let's get started. I can't really reach this guy. Maybe this will work. So I'm going to move here using one AP. And then I'm going to try bashing this guy. I'm going to press... Oh. You just use the skill. You can check out the skill roster in the action bar. They run out. Okay, so yeah, it's pretty basic stuff so far. So I'm going to press three. Good. Bash him. Hold all to expand. Oh, you can see there. Uh, oh, it's a hundred percent. Damn, it's XCOM, huh? All right, let's go. Huh. Dang, a pushback. Oh, the blue is his armor. I got you. Okay, you move five tiles. Use your environment. Range attacks can be blocked by cover. When you hover over a target, attacks coming from beyond the red lines are less likely to hit. To see how likely it is, pay attention to the yellow percentile. You got it. A uh, shoot. Up to six tiles. So press two. Ah, they're out of range. Mm, out of range. What's this? Self cast. Ready and ready a reaction. Taking a shot. Taking a shot against the first enemy that moves within your line of sight until the next turn. Ah, so this is a um. How the hell's it called in uh, XCOM? Uh, Overwatch. It's a little dangerous to Overwatch because these guys are gonna walk right up. So I think we're just gonna walk up together and shoot these guys. So I'm gonna do one. And we're gonna just move here. How much? Six tiles? One, two, three. Yeah, we can hit him if I go here. So we'll go here. I wonder if we can go back. Can I go back? Yeah, you can revert. That's good. Unless it does a side effect. Okay, two. Go hit this guy. Take ya. Uh, All right. So I guess it's best to focus one guy. So let's look at this guy. Cinch. Uh, five tiles. Four damage to an enemy. Hephaestation Salt. Restore four armor to an ally. I wonder if I can see their abilities. Hmm. And then this is heal eight cooldown one turn, but it uses up a mana. I don't know when mana recovers, so maybe we should not use that. And uh, when this one, when casting a spell, no attacks can miss. So that means if I use this beforehand, we're not going to miss no matter what. All right. So this is a four. So if I move, ooh, actually it's pretty far. Uh, can I go through like walls? Damn it, this is a four, huh? One, two, okay, this will be a little dangerous. Let's let's see how smart the AI is. I want to put this weak character up in front. I'm gonna use the singe here. We'll get this guy. This guy's behind us. I think I can't even hit. Him. Okay, enemy's going. Okay, we're gonna get flanked from behind. He's shooting. Uh oh. Oof. I can hold space to fast forward, but why Why do that? Stand ready. Stand ready one. What is stand? What the hell? Oh, man. Okay, so this is a roguelike. I'm assuming um, HP damage might be forever, but armor is probably in between matches and recovers. A unit header prevents an at glance information. Okay, you got it. Okay. Stats effects are part of the hand of Merlin. Make sure to hover over to see the debuffs and buffs. So this guy. Stand ready allows reactions. Striking an enemy that moves or attacks. Uh oh. Expires. Losing all stacks at the end of the turn. Striking that moves or... Oh, man. Wait, who's the weakened guy? Look at his, uh, his armor is back up to nine. Oh, no. This guy. I have to beat this guy down. So this guy's gonna... Yeah, he's, he reacted to me. Damn, smart AI. Look at that. I can still move. Oh, okay, I have a passive effect. If I miss, I get one point. Yeah, I can't really do much. Guess I'm gonna... I don't want to move. I don't know if he actually activates his move again, but it's okay. We'll just pass. How to pass. I don't know how to pass. Oh, wait, 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 wait. move characters. All right. 
Unfortunately, if I move, I'm going to get attacked, right? But... Ah, damn it. But if I stay here, I'm going to get attacked even more. I'm going to have to just walk away. I'm going to get hit. Oh, no. He used it up. I thought he was doing, doing it multiple times. All right. Here we go. Let's finish this guy. Four. 100% chance of one-shotting him now. Pew, pew. Okay. We're going to keep backing up. One, two, three, four. I'm going to move here. I'm going to singe this guy. What's this one? Restores four armor. Uh, let's restore four armor. Yeah. I restore four. And this guy D has one more. Okay, that's it. All right. All right, he's slashing me. So it looks like uh, you don't need to turn your character around or anything. That's good. I'm glad I uh, recovered that. It looks like they're going to hit me, though. He's going to hit me. He just activated stand. Hmm, interesting. Oh. I got activated. He moved, stand, and then he attacked. Wow, he has three actions or what? Eight. He has 16 health. This guy has a 19 health. This guy has 19 health. Uh, we got to just kill the guy closest to us. I, I got to just do that. I'm about to take some damage here now. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to just... This is not the best situation here. I don't know how to use cover effectively yet. But we got to take them out before they take me out. That's what we got to do right now. I mean, you can say that about everything. But still. Oof. All right. Let's do it. Hey, I can push him away and destroy his, uh, his stand, right? No. I can't believe his reaction went first before my stand. I was going to bash him. Uh, I should have slashed and bashed. If I didn't move, I was able to use these two attacks. I, I don't have a defend move. So, yeah, I messed up. A slash and bash would have been the best move. Definitely. So, I, that's a wasted move. I guess I'll just move here. All right. So, I can shoot in the individual, which is great. Oh, he's too close. Are you kidding me? He's too close. He's too close, man. I'm going to move here and just shoot. How much damage? A first shot. It doesn't say even say how much. Damn, you can't hit him unless he's in front of you, huh? I mean, unless he's one one away. Ay ay ay. Oh, this is fun. End the turn. I think we'll get through this for sure. I need to recover his armor. Oh, man. Bruner's getting beat up. Oh, the slash. Wow, they're just going all over the place. To the left, there are some options to show how things are rendered. I'm good. Alright. Uh, I can only slash and move. This guy's annoying, but we gotta kill these guys in the front. Alright, get him. That's it for you. Uh, I guess I will shoot. Damn it. I, I wanna make the most use of my stuff here, so I'm gonna shoot. And then go on vigil. We're splitting our damage up a little, but I'm, I want to activate Vigil. How do I activate it? Self-cast. All right. So we're not going to move. Six health, four health. Take this guy out. He's not dead. But now we can activate this now. Yeah, so actually not moving is really good. Assuming these other skills are not on cooldown, right? Ah, it hurts. Oh, Bruder. Standed. Oh my god, he's gonna die. Ouch. My vigilance didn't do anything. Reaction shoot. It didn't work. Man, we're getting here. Oh, there you go. Alright, Archer's Vigil. Let's go. Okay, this guy is uh, 10 health. We could probably kill him this turn now. Alright. Get him! Send him! Is he on stand? No. I can move. I can move and attack. Um. Yeah, let's do that. I want to move here. I want. I want the the archer to have a higher chance of attacking this character. He's higher health. Five. Okay. I don't even need to bash him. Okay. 
Press one, move over. Press two, attack. All right. So I want to move this guy closer. Hopefully he can take the hit because he has armor, right? Let's see. Okay, that's good. Well, it, I mean, I wanted these guys to take it over. The other guy. Okay, just in, well, how much HP you got? All right, let's do this. Damn, I have to just, I have to use two to get there, huh? That's fine. I'll do it. Block him in, you know. All right, let's move right here using one AP. Singe him. Singe him. And the HP. I really hope you you recover HP between fights, but I don't know. We'll see. Alright. There you go. Sprinting, evade, three, and shoot. Dude, he's gonna die. No, he's good. You don't have anything crazy, right? Alright. One AP. And then bash him. Ha! Miss! I get the one AP for missing. So I can attack again. Nice. Alright, you dead, homie. I'm gonna walk up right to your face. I'm gonna send you in your ass. Alright, we got through it. Okay, we got 50 bucks, some uh, some stuff. Yeah, look at that. We don't heal. Ooh. Gain Poppy of the East or get Renown? What's Poppy? It's a relic. Gains one stack of Lethargic and one action point this round. Lethargic. Uh, draw. Wait, what is this? What's that? Draw negative one action points per turn. Losing all stacks. Pump. Uh oh. Oh, it's it's basically a trade-off. You get one more AP this point uh, this turn, but you screw it next turn. Sure. Can I choose who gets it? Congratulations on your progress. You've gotten resources. When you have 50 renown, you can rank up. Oh no way. How, how do you rank up? In the journal? Oh. Warband. Attributes. You have access to the Grail, a special relic. You can see who carries it. Oh, really? This is the Grail. Oh. Stash? Drag it to store it here? That's So this one never goes away. This one's good on him. I like, I like this on him. Skills. Reach Warband 2 to unlock a skill. No armor upgrades. Look at that. You can change up their stuff. Ah, the Warband. All right. Pick a new skill. Click on the open slot. Skills are picked from a random pools and give you different play styles. Each character has also gained some health. To increase your other attributes, find a blacksmith. All right. So let's click. Oh, let's get a new skill. All right. We, we pick one, huh? This is pretty cool. All right. Deal four damage to all units in melee range. Nice. Stand ready. Ready of reaction. I like that because it's free, but it's three three turn cooldown, but it's free. Gain three defensive resists. What's resist? Negative 50% damage from all resources. Losing one stack per attack received. Whoa, so you activate it. Oh, I like that. We need a tank, so this guy should do that, huh? Nice. I like that. Let's go. Even though he's very close to death. <laughs> all right, what do you got? Barbed arrow. Deal three damage to an enemy and extra four if unarmored. Two charges, meaning two per encounter, I'm assuming. Um, it's not bad. Sprint. Move to a location on arrival, gain three stacks. Does not prompt reaction. That's pretty good. Two charges again. Smoke cloud. Create a smoke cloud. Four shrouded to all units. Uh, so everyone, everyone, all units, even enemies. Negative accuracy for evasion is not a K. Interesting. I think we just get the barbed arrow. Extra damage is fine. Okay. Hollow utility. Uh, applying a hollowing ore around the caster, giving two stacks of hollowed in a three tile radius. Plus two power. Plus two power. I wonder if that's just straight out like damage, right? I guess he can combo with the archer for like a buffer. 
Um, corrosive concoction. Six armor damage to all units in a cone. Wow. Two charges. So this is a one-time use for three turns. Uh, this a ro Eloic Elixir. Apply three stacks of quick. Plus three speed. I don't know what speed means in this game. I don't know. It could be evasion or something. Speed. How far they can move. Ah, how far they can move. I like this one. Okay. So it's every 50, right? So it went down. It went down from 50 to 4. Cool. Okay. Let's keep going. We're probably going to lose our character in the next match. Huh? Okay. We're definitely going to have to heal him. I don't know what mana does. I really hope I didn't waste mana. Okay. So we can't do anything but the regular node. You can't backtrack or anything. Yeah. You got to keep going forward. Continue down the road. Take another path to avoid Robin. He's a terrible robber. Uh, let's avoid for now. Take some time to note the different types of nodes. You can see the legend on the right. After a time, they can become corrupted. In those nodes, it can be really bad. What does this mean? There's a thing over that. A two. Can I go this way? No, you got to keep going forward. I see where the arrows are pointing. So I could have gone this way. Like may make it a little bit longer of a fight uh, of a journey. I see. Okay, so we have to. We no choice. No choice. I'm gonna die here. Ready? Drum on his helmet. Leave with your dignity attacked. My drum is a helmet. Let's try this. Drum on his helmet. I'm gonna roll. Oh, with, um. What's going on? Golden supplies. Continue your journey. Oh, so so we so we messed the we messed around with some guy and he was lucky. He's like, okay. Corrupted node. Nah. I'm excited to go to that arcade node here. Enter the inn or come on. Or continue on. I, hopefully an inn will be nice. A room for the night. Well rested. Does not decay. We get one speed and armor. Is that forever for the run? Gimme. Give Gimme Give the armor. Well rested. Does not, does not decay. No way. Get dressed and head downstairs. Get dressed and exit through the window. So it's showing. So this is an extra encounter because of this character. You are woken by the sound of fighting downstairs. Let's go through the window. Help the innkeeper. The risk is too great. Now let's help the innkeeper. Fight or command them to stop with this guy. 75% chance. Stop it. Success, success, failure. All right. We have a three out of four chance of winning. Always pick left, by the way. Success. Defend the inn. For a moment, the men freeze. They're afraid of you, but they're too greedy to flee. Ah, we obtained powerful because we got the check. So we got two power, losing one stack per turn. So we're strong for two turns. Nice. Okay. So it was going to be a fight there no matter what, I guess. Even if we got to fail. Okay. This game's cool. Oh, they're going first. Oh, come on. Thank God we got the well-rested bonus. So that was really nice. All right, it's three on three. I wonder if we can change up um, how our characters like go into fights, like their loadouts or whatever. Red means to deal damage. Blue is positive. Green is a movement. Purple is negative. Yellow it'll make something. Yeah, okay, you got it. Okay, shield block, self cast. All right, they're all archers. Let's start with this guy, huh? I kind of want to heal just to see if uh, the mana comes back. Heal. So that does not use up anything. Prophetic aim activated. I can do, uh, well, I was thinking of doing concoction. Five damage to an ally for singeing. That's right, we're strong, so we should we should make use of this and try to kill him quickly. Singe his ass! We have one more um, thing left. Oh, I should have hollowed! <laughs> I should have hollowed! To get the power! Alright. Switch over here. Move in with one. Plus two hollowed, so I get more damage. So if they are unarmored, it's 
well, it's six damage in general. Eight? So this is ten if they're unarmored. This is eight. Oh my god. Get him! Oh, this guy's so dead. I'm gonna walk up and hit him. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to use a shield block here, but take a guy out in the very first attack. Let's go. Boom! Alright, let's go, man. Oh, four. I need to heal his armor. Prepare bomb? We're preparing? Preparing. Disrupt it? Oh, we're gonna disrupt them, alright. So move and bash. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna bash him here. I don't wanna push him back. Move. Bash. Bash, bitch! Oh, I pushed him up. Nice. Alright, let's get him. Take it, boy. <clears throat> Alright, five health left. I'm just gonna. Oh, it costs two? Oh, no, it's four charm. Okay, I've got it. Let's do it. Kill him. I'll use my uh, piercer. He didn't get the buff, but he's dead. Okay. Um, let's move up. This other guy is useless. Let's get him. Let's move up. Oh, it's around me. Wait, does this one go away? Yeah, it goes away. Oh. There right, we go. Heal, my friend. Your armor. What are you going to do? It doesn't matter who he hits. We have armor enough for days. Prepare the potion. That's what you going to do? We go prepare the potion? All right, man. Suck. Regular attack. You're good. Can I attack him from here? No. Um, okay, that's cost two. It's cost one. Can I attack from here? Yeah, you can. 40% though. Oh. Wait, did we disrupt him? Enfeeble. Four damage dealt. What? All right. One AP. I am still hollow. That means he's hollow too, right? Or is that only for amigos? I don't know. I'm hover hovering over him. I didn't say. Nice armor attack. I like that armor though. Let's get him, boys. Ah, if I want to make the most use of... Oh, it's gone. I was going to say, we move in with the hollow man. Then we do whatever. So we have no one on my team that has like a uh, like a real healing ability yet. That'd be really nice. Bash him! Push his ass back. 100%? You're dead? You're dead? <laughs> Nice. You defeated the enemy. I did that. We took no damage. In fact, we healed. But that used up a mana. 50 bucks and three. Uh, I get no renown. I get renown for the fight. Uh, arcane or heroic? No. See, this is interesting. I don't know what that means. So we get mana, essence, whatever essence is. Oh, essence is for the, the our, our guardian core and uh, relic. This one is looking at the thing on the right. We obtain a hero. That's what heroic node. Having another character sounds amazing. I'm just gonna go right there. Greet him. Continue. Uh, what do you make of King Gawain? Uh, he is lost in the past. You speak the truth. Meet the blacksmith. Continue your journey. Mm. All right. You could upgrade heroes equipment. Making them more efficient. Up to five times. Two styles for each, so do a play style. Oh, I see. So we can go one power or one evasion on this guy. Evasion. I wonder how strong evasion is. Armor or uh, way more armor negative speed. <laughs> this is cool. All right, we need the guy to be up crazy. Tanking it up. The negative speed, though. That's fine, dude. I'm gonna upgrade this. Omega oh, armor. What, what do you do? Armor and same thing. Armor and armor and accuracy down. Who cares about accuracy? Power and range. Ooh. Nah, the range is whatever. I feel like that's gonna come into play way less than power. Power or range? Okay, so uh, we don't have that much money. Um, fuck. Uh, I can upgrade it again. 
but a negative one more speed. Wait, no, it's not a negative one more speed. Oh, oh, it's just well, what it is. It's just going up to 13. Oh, I can go back and forth. Uh, we should probably just give everyone a lot of armor right now. Yeah, negative speed. I don't think we need that much speed. Accuracy. Yeah, give, give me the armor. Give me the armor. Just give me the armor. A huge armor. That's what I'm going to try out. Okay, there's a corrupted node. If we go here, we can go to the city. See, we can heal at the city. I like that. What happened? Oh. Oh. Leave the area. We didn't get another hero, though. Maybe because we, um... We said wrong on the, on the choice or whatever. Approach or leave? Quite farm. Approach. Help the woman. Advance corruption. Shortening timers and all nodes, but we get a hella crap. Gimme. I don't even know how bad corruption is yet, so who cares? Alright. Now we get to go to the city. Enter the city. Market explore healer. This is 15 to everyone? 10 to everyone? No. Minor healing. Take, take him and leave. Explore. Lost, lost, or you can find the seer. Ooh. Always go left. The seer, baby. Always go left. Follow him. Why not? Accept the gift. Fragment. This is a um, passive. Four armor on a kill. Oh, sick. Four armor on kill. Th this means we should probably prioritize this, you know, if anything. Marketplace. I don't have that much money. Trade supplies. I can sell some of these. I'm going to sell a little bit. Go back. Go to the relic shop. Oh, it's actual shop shop. Nice. Poppy of the East. Another poppy? Holy water? Deal six health to abominations. So it's only good against abominations, huh? Caltrops. Toss it in range two on contact. Max charge one. So it's just one time. That's <laughs> uh, not the worst. So we don't want to sell this, right? Four armor on a kill. Poppy of the... I forgot I had this. I kind of want to sell this. I don't really care for that. Uh, I don't know. I think these guys should switch for sure. This is useless, but Caltrops is useless on him as well. I guess we just don't do anything here. I think we just sell this. Oh, there's a blacksmith here too. Alright, let's power up. More evasion? or Give me the power, man. I want this guy. He's going to be up front. I should have put it on her. No, 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 on him. Because we want, if, if possible, we want him to get the last hit to get the armor. Okay, we're good. I think that's fine. Good place. Find a place to rest. Continue your journey. There's a corrupted node. Heroic node. Or the regular, 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 regular. <laughs> and the, it's corrupted city. Uh-oh. Let's give the regulars. Approach it. Throw a rock to scare it. Approach it. Feed it some scraps. Feed it or shoo it. I think we can... Uh, I think we'll get lucky and find some supplies. So I'll feed it at three. I got three. Oh, we got some renown. Nice. So I can go to the Lind... Lind? Linda? Let's go. Extreme danger. Yeah, whatever. We'll see about that. Examine the statue. Donate some food. If I do, I, I, I'm out. I'm out of food. I can't. I have... Oh, two dollars! Approach the lake. Ask for help. Accept the gift! I got an essence, baby. Wake up. Continue your journey. Nice! Not bad. I got an essence, so I can, I can get a new ability now. Stasis. Apply two stacks of stasis. They cannot act. Wow. This is a uh, two mana. Oh, it's also two mana. I don't have one mana. Maybe I should just buy another one mana. Thunderbolt, 15 to an enemy. Wow. 
Warp. What? Create a space of a localized space-time distortion, applying two stacks of negative warp to enemies. Negative warps is negative speed. Me, us is higher speed. Oh. I think I'm just going to get this Thunderbolt. Just keep it nice and simple. We got a healing for one, and this one for two, and there's a third one. I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> I wonder if these are random. These one that pop up. All right. Let's not worry about it. Okay. Regular node or corrupted? Give me the regular node. Talk around, talk around, talk around. Huh. Notice something amiss? Prepare for combat? Alright. Campfire tails, baby. Bring it. Oh, God. Four enemies. Eight. Niners. And eighters. Oh, these guys are nothing. These guys are bitches. Alright, we're good. We're good. Alright. Uh, let's see. Can I attack from here? No. It looks like... Uh, looks like they have to walk around. So we can set up an attack here. That's good. Okay, so let's do this. Let's set up camp. If I dash here to start off with, we could have two to prepare for the next thing. Actually, I want the archer to be here. This guy should be here. I'm gonna dash. This guy's won't. This guy's most likely won't be able to get up, right? Yeah, we're dashing. Man, this guy goes over here. Dash. Let's get behind. Let's go here. All right, bring it. All right, that's good. He used one AP though. That's fine. Good on you, Archer. He has to walk all the way around. Okay. Now it's time to do stuff. Okay. Let's start off by getting hollowed. More power. All right. Now we're going to walk up to here. Can I shoot from here? No. I got to walk up. All right. I'm hollowed, but now I can attack. Go for the 8-8. Eight, eight. How much damage is that? I didn't even see. Seven. That's pretty good. Pretty freaking good. All right. Now... Uh, gosh. Okay. I'm going to walk up one more. Here. And we're going to defense. Shield block. Three resistances. This recovers four to an uh, armor's ally. His max armor. Yeah, I can do that. All right. Max armor. Up. Oh. Regular armor. Now, we see what the enemy does. Haha, -ha. good resistance. I'm a tank, baby. Let's go. These guys are nothing. Bitch. Stand. Oh, he can attack from the corner? Oh, man. I didn't know that. Oh, well. Alright. Alright, I want to get two attacks in. I don't want to move. I want to get two attacks in. So we're going to do regular attack and then bash him. That's a lot of damage. Get out of here! It's a lot of damage. We could probably kill this guy right now. Six. 100% death. We're gonna take a hit here. Whatever. Ow! Hollow be damage, bitch! Okay. And we can barb arrow somebody. He has one armor on him. Darn. If we can knock off the one armor. Uh, actually, it doesn't really matter. Okay, I'm gonna move up. Move up. 30%. 30%? Really? Well, I, I guess we really did lower our accuracy on this guy. I mean, the accuracy doesn't matter too much if we're healing a lot, you know? Oh, jeez. If I hit him, that'd be really nice. Yeah. Darn. Alright. Try Archer's Vigil or Barbed Arrow? Just get this guy in. Forty percent. Uh oh, damn it! I uh, the percentage. I keep forgetting. All right, that's fine. Whatever. Activate vigil. All right, all right. We're fine. Look at our armor. We're still good. Look at uh, dude. Okay, resistance is gone. Almost gone, right? 
Yeah, his resistance is gone. He's taking max damage now. That's okay. Whatever. He, he did his job. They're all not moving. All right. Let's beat this guy's ass. Mm, if I walk up to him, though. Okay. Well, let's go. We need to chase him down. All right. Take this. That was a 90%, by the way. Honestly, that that was a 90%. Dang it. We're really going to take all this time to take out one guy. Oh, that's really bad. All right. 100%. Man, that sucked. So these guys don't get hollowed, right? For sure. For sure. Oof. All right, as long as we don't take max health, we're good. Yeah, all right, all right, we're good. Owie. All right, hollow? Hollow's gone now, huh? Let's see, can we use hollow again? That's one time for battle. I can do this. All right, we're ready to do it. Just get him. All right, Let's do some regular slashes, man. This is five, this is five and a knockback. Knockback is whatever. That's only good for disrupting right now. Uh, what am I gonna do here? I can't really attack the guy next to me. I can do a double attack on this guy. Hold on. Four, how much is that? Four damage. And this is five damage plus seven. Plus three. Can we do 16 damage to this guy this turn? Oh, I should have messed up. Hold on. So if I do four, that takes him down to uh, four armor. I hit this, four armor to one, seven HP, and then I do this is seven. Oh, perfect! That's like perfect. Yeah, assuming this hits, by the way. The ninety percent. Wow, that's really nice. That's cool. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> what the hell, dude? Ugh! Just kill this guy, dude. Come on. I have to remember to try to give the kill to uh, my swordsman, though, so he gets the armor. It's kind of applicable here. He's standing. He's slashing. Is he attacking? He's running. He's so close to taking max health. we got to be careful. Uh, can we kill this guy? Oh, man. Oh. All right. Armor for Bruner. Hit this guy. 90%. Man, the negative accuracy. Ooh, a little rough, huh? Can I bash his ass? I want to go in and take the hit. Uh, three. Whatever. Bash him. Yeah. Knockdown. What's knockdown do? Oh, he's dead? Never mind. Is he, is, can I hit him here? Okay, this is good. This is good. <laughs> so, yes. All right. All right, everyone's armor is above. We're good. No one's going to take max health here. Good fight. Very good encounter. Yeah, this game's pretty sweet. Freaking tactical roguelike. That's awesome. We'll walk over here. Singe him, get rid of his armor. If we get rid of his armor, stop missing! What? What the 90% chance, dude? Regular attack, get rid of his armor. Now we can finish him with this. So she do seven damage. But he's only at six. All right, got him. Wow, that was cool. I have enough to level up again. So I'm assuming all their stats just go up little by little, huh? All right, another skill. Um, stagger blow. Apply one stack of staggered. Cannot use offensive abilities. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's pretty sweet. It doesn't do any damage, but you stagger. I guess if it's like a crazy enemy, right? What's this? Three stacks of powerful, losing one stack per turn. No. Haste. Grants one action point to the caster. 
Wow, that's really good. That's amazing. I like that. Because this is forever. You just got to use it every three turns. Let's get haste. Sprint. Take aim. Three stacks of aiming. Attacks don't miss. Losing all stacks. Aspires. Losing all stacks after attacking. Three range. Three range. So you activate this and you fire, huh? Quick draw. Two damage twice. Same target or two, two separate ones. I like this because it's just straight damage. Like, she, she's just like the... And we can... We're, we're, we're a buffer, you know? I mean, we buffer. Hopefully we get a buff here. Raise totem. Create a low cover target at target position. Oh, that's neat. Six armor, two units in a cone. Desecrate in area and range. Two damage on contact for three turns. Once again, I don't know if it works on enemies or anything. We'll do a low cover. That seems fun. We got a tank, a pure attacker, and a little bit of defense there. Alright, we're almost at the corruption. We can see how to end this first act. Attempt a bargain. 50% infuse or intimidate some brigands. Bargain for 50%. Success or failure, huh? Always go left. Except when the game expects it. LOL! I'm really good at that. Aha! What? You sense a leader before to kill you. Pay in blood or <laughs> pay in gold to leave? And here's the deal. Here's the deal. I want to be... I don't know how crazy this, uh, this fight's going to be. I want to be at the fullest health possible. So even though we could probably take this fight, no problemo. I will just take, take my gold. Whatever, dude. I just definitely want to see this. Draw the attention or shoe the beast. We get power. Losing stacks when taking damage. Two damage to next attack. Or defend the gates. Shoot the beast, draw the attention. Power. Defend the gates. So there's no benefit if you just choose to defend the gate. You get those two options because our characters. Oh my god, what the hell? Those must be abominations. Gaze? Wow. Holy moly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's work. All right. Abominations. Stay sharp. Each abomination has unique passives. This is going to be great. I think we should put our, uh, our main guy here. And put the lady here. And then put this guy here. All right, what do we got? Bloodlust. When hit, gain out of turn action with plus one action. Oh my god. On death, seven damage to all enemies in melee. On death, all enemies in melee. Uh, gain out of turn action and reset cooldowns when dealt health damage. Jesus Christ. How many are there? Just four, huh? This is go to great. When should I use this? Walking up. Should use this right away. Because it doesn't decay unless we take damage. Alright. Let's just move here. Let's just move here. This guy has good movement. I can do a uh, totem. If I do a totem here, that means they can't walk in here. That's great, right? Okay, so I'm gonna they're probably gonna walk in the middle, so I'm gonna totem here when they get close. We use hollow now. I'll save it for next turn. I want this to last a while. I guess we end our turn. We'll, we'll, we'll let him walk up. Yikes. Oh man, they're so fast. Oh man, they are so much faster than I thought they were going to be. I should have looked at their speed. All right. This is fine. Okay. The haste! I'll take out these guys first. Dash for two! Smack him. <laughs> Alright, not bad, not bad. I don't want to move here. I want to do two attacks. 
This guy has a lot of armor. We'll do a regular attack. I'm stupid, dude. I should use the hollow. Uh, she has to move up if she wants to get the hollow damage. One to AP. Create a barrier. Just wanted to see it. Guess I'm moving. Take this, bitch. Really? What was the percent there? Who's going? Goes again. Quick draw. I think we use the vigilance. Ah, uh, not the best start. Take that. Oh my god! Did I not read the trample ability or whatever that is? Oh my god. What's that? He's preparing? It's okay, we can encounter that. Oh my. Archer's vigil. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Alright. First things first. Bash this guy preparing. Prepare these nuts. I don't want to move. I want to keep striking. Got to make the most of our, our turn. Man. Let's see. What's your percent to hit? I can't even see. What's the percent? Oh. Who should we give this to? For my lady. Heal. Armor up. Where's that watchful eye at? Alright, there's this guy. I got a four. Damn, she can't reach. Alright, I guess we're just gonna attack this guy. Damn. Hiya! Take it! Three! Bash! Out of turn action with one counter. But can you hit me from there? Let's see. We use the uh, small attack. Out of turn. Oh, he gets our AP. I thought it was one. Oh, okay. That's totally fine. Bitch. Uh, I think she's gonna die. Yeah, this has gone all sorts of bad. In this game, looks like you really need to read everything, you know? Oh no. Yeah, this is crazy. I'm glad we got up to here. Oh, man. Medicinal boost? Medicinal boost? What was the medicinal boost? That was something I got at the very beginning of the game. Oh, we can do a thunderbolt. No, I can't. I can only do restoration. Man, should we just smork this guy? Oh, man. I, I, I don't think I can just take him out. I gotta just... 90% just gotta, gotta kill him. Melee range explosion, right? There's no one here. I have no more moves. Should I move? Let's move. Alright. What should I do here? I gotta just kill this guy. Ah, he's so strong! Like, should I run? Maybe we just run. Maybe we just ditch this guy. We keep fighting these guys for now. Does he have armor? He does. Oh, I don't even have my uh, pierce ready. Okay, it's not over yet. Jesus, the Watcher! Powerful. Powerful. Ouch. Eight. He's preparing. Ease clap. Oh, I got slowed by two and corrupted. All right, I might have to heal the archer now. Definitely have to heal the archer now. Too bad you can't use thunderbolt. All right, I gotta bash this guy. Oh, what's going on? He's stunned for a turn. I hope you guys can hear my. My neighbor playing their loud ass music in front of the whole neighborhood. Very cool. I love to listen to the music. 
Oh my god, that's really terrible. That sucks. Alright. I have two moves here. Looks like I'm gonna probably give self armor. Then I'm gonna throw it on this guy. 100%! Okay, way to kill this guy, right? So we can do quick draw. Five. Quick draw. Quick draw. Double quick draw attack. Q. Q. Oh, and I hit him seven. I would like one more to attack the Watcher, but we're too close, so I have to back up. All right, we'll go. Oh my god, he's chasing my archer down. She's dead. She's so dead. Oh god. It's over. Prophetic arm. Aim and slowed. She's dead. There's no way. But there was no way. Oh man. Oh, you can see the power. Two knockback. Bad. Power up. Oh, the oh, the speed down is making a big uh, difference here. Oh well. Bash him. <laughs> Kill this bitch. I'm gonna have the archer run now. You'll take three upon moving there. Oh Jesus. Run. God, it's gonna get trampled. Okay, take it, hoe. See, I, I just don't know if it's better to attack. You know, attack the big boss straight out. Oh, good. He just moved for no reason. Horror. <coughs> Preparing, vulnerable. All right, beat this guy. Then. <laughs> Out of turn. All right, armor up. It's hundred percent chance. Let's see. Three, four. Take this, bitch. Um, I don't know. Uh, this this out of turn shit. Actually, I can Vigil Archer. Whatever. This does more damage. That out of turn bullshit. It's crazy. Oh, he has no more moves. Are we going to win? Don't. Oh, we're going to die. I know, we're, I know one of us is going to die. Ah! Oh, Morgan. Ah! Quick draw. Come on! We can't do it. I got no more moves left, right? I got no more shit up my sleeve. No mana or anything. Oh, man. Archer's Vijal. Fuck you! Ah! Ah! <laughs> I can't. I can't! He's coming! Oh my god! I mean, I expected it. Your world is lost, doomed to be consumed by the cataclysm. You feel Merlin's spirit abandoning you, seeking out other worlds. Oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> hey, you can see all the stuff. Turn to the lobby. Nice! Core inspection, hero inspection, pass runs. So, if I go to the core inspection. Merlin and there's one more underneath me unlocked so these are unlocked forever so we can choose to do stuff I guess this one probably unlocks either when we beat a run or something and then we can unlock heroes nice defeat a behemoth on a single action do 20 with a ranger wow spend five mana before I'm reaching Marca Hispanica kill 10 humans with the warrior Defeat three enemies in a single turn. Hey, they're annoying, huh? All right. Good game. All right, so check it out. This game comes out today as the thing is uploading. 
Um, I'm going to do a first impression review, so make sure to watch out for that. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps a lot. If you haven't already subscribed to Arena for daily videos, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.